I've been wondering if you can start a career in carbon removal right now. We're in the middle of a pandemic, carbon removal is a, a small but growing industry. Is this something that, that people are doing? And so I asked on Airminer Slack in the, in the jobs channel, I said, hey, is there anybody here who's started a, a new job in carbon removal in the last six months? And seven people stepped forward and said, yes, they had, they had done this. My big takeaway from this was just hearing in all these responses was people really shifting careers. They're bringing their skills from one industry and, and bringing that to carbon removal. There's somebody from the, from the software industry who became a chief of staff at a direct air capture company. There's an academic researcher who became a researcher mapping out different carbon removal projects. Uh, there's somebody who worked in communications who now is part of a podcast on carbon removal. So there's this really powerful narrative around the transferability of skills, of, of being able to bring, uh, bring all your experience, bring your curiosity, bring everything that you've learned in other parts of life, bring that to carbon removal. You don't need to know everything about sorbents or about soils. You just need to have some curiosity and the, and the kind of audacity to say, you know what, I'm gonna go work in this, in this field. The other thing that stood out to me about this is that, you know, I, I recognize these people. I know these people. A, a year ago, they many of them were kind of starting to explore carbon removal, starting to get, get interested and, and, and learn about it. And a year later, these people are the future leaders. These people are, you know, they're at the helm working on these companies, working on these solutions, working on these, these projects to help people understand and connect with carbon removal. And that's really inspiring. Just being able to, to think that, you know, a year from now, imagine how many more people are going to be working in carbon removal who, who today are, are just getting started or who today are kind of wondering, ah, oh, you know, I wonder if this is right for me. I wonder if it's, is, is it a good time to get a job in carbon removal? So I really liked uh, this discussion. If you've started working in carbon removal, I'd love to hear from you. Uh, there's a link to the Slack uh, discussion here if you're part of Airminer Slack. Otherwise, you can, you can post in the comments. Uh, there's also a lot of wisdom that these people have. They've, they've figured out how to navigate the jobs market uh, in COVID in a very, very new industry like carbon removal. Uh, and so maybe there's a potential of, of getting these people together and, uh, and, and sharing some more of their wisdom or you know, doing kind of a QA and a session or something. Um, so stay tuned for, for something like that in the, in the future. And I look forward to hearing about other people that have started a job in the last six months or other people that are going to be starting new jobs in carbon removal. Uh, over the next couple of months.